here's the start of the quad down to the river, North Saskatchewan River.
you got to go up top there? Mm-hmm. Oh, man. Greg's in search of the gold nugget now, on the North Saskatchewan. Over there. Well, it's too much of a... Yeah. So here we are in the North Saskatchewan River. Uh, we thought we'd set our high banker up today to see how, how we could do. We met a guy out here yesterday who had one of our competitor's mats and he was running his tailings in his pan here. We showed him how to back pan and he had what Greg? A couple hundred specks at least in, yeah, his, in his tailings from that competitor's mat. So we thought today we'd come out here and try the Devon Gold BDR. And here we are. And this is our first run. What do we run? 10 minutes? 15 minutes? Yeah, 10, 15 minutes. Maybe 10 pails max. They're tiny, but they are plentiful. They are very small. Flower gold, which is expertise of the VDR mat. Just look at all that. There's still some more in the other pan. So we'll get it all in one pan. That's a lot of little dots. Yeah, for sure. So pretty easy shoveling too, like we didn't, we have the high banker set at the top, we'll show that shortly and uh, see what we got here. So this is our setup here, we got the pump set up here, we're in the North Saskatchewan, it's uh, May long weekend here in Alberta, Canada. That's our pump set up, beautiful view of the river, gorgeous day, beautiful, beautiful. May long weekends here in Alberta, hit or miss. You never know if you're going to have good weather or what's going to go. And here we've got the answer set up on top of the hill. Oops, let me adjust in here. And we shoveled, I don't know, not that many shovelfuls and uh, about probably six or eight buckets, uh, three quarters full. And we got that whole amount of little tiny flower goals. Back to work shortly. Here we are. This is the second bit of that first clean out on the Fort Saskatchewan River. It's hard to see them in here, Greg. I can't kind of get them. They don't show. Oh, there we go. They're starting to show up in there. Very, very tiny, but lots and lots of them. So this is still from our first clean out. First day on the North Saskatchewan River, May long weekend, Alberta, Canada. Beautiful day. North Saskatchewan River. We're just out here with our friends, Ron and Sharon. We have Little Nugget here surveying the situation. She's been apprenticing with uh, Flower Gold Wizards Rigby, trying to spot the gold, but as you can see, she's taken a break. Over here we have Greg, Prospector Greg, and our friend Ron helping us with this whole process today. We've been out camping for the weekend, and as mentioned earlier, we came across a person earlier yesterday who was out here with a little sluice, and he had uh, one of our competitors' mats in there. And he was just going through his tailings and he was a new newbie so Greg assisted him with uh, taught him how to back pan and stuff and we found over 200 pieces uh, tiny flower gold in his tailings so we thought today oh it's our turn to come out here and and give it a turn so we're just getting set up we did one little run um, earlier and lots and lots of tiny flower gold so we're there we're just in the process of getting the pump and everything going again and we'll be back at her we just worked 15 minutes spurts it seems and uh, seem to be doing good. Oh, here comes Prospect for Greg. He's going to start up the Honda pump. It's a beautiful day out here in the North Saskatchewan. It's the um, uh, long weekend in Canada. So here we go, pump going. going on here earlier was just we were filling up for about halfway the five gallon pails and Greg was also shoveling directly in so get the going let's see what, how things go this uh, is our new high banker um, that you can buy on the infinity prospecting website uh, we just running through the bucket to rock through and away we go The answer 
just chomp through all this. We don't even have our gravy in there to do the rocks. So this goes directly in. Greg earlier was uh, just shoveling in there as well. So we'll go closer and see. dogs barking, nuggets barking. We have some fishermen walking down the pathway there, so I'll better go see what we're calling. Okay, here we are just wrapping up our day. We probably put in maybe, I don't know, probably not even an hour's worth of work. Here's uh, what we have to show for it. Greg will be doing the cleanup here shortly. Uh, maybe even we'll take it back to our camp to process it. Here's kind of, as you can see, we didn't work that big of a an area here. And here we are. The ants are once again doing an awesome job. Here's some video of the bank behind us. You can see the layers here are a lot of barren clay on the top from flood depositions, but below it are a lot of round river cobble and a bunch of different layers that contain varying amounts of flower gold. This is the final cleanup for our uh, um, mining last weekend on the North Saskatchewan River. Uh, we're just, Greg just did the final pan out here. We had to wait till we got home and had time to get through it. Uh, so we're going to clean this, or dry this up, and give it away. So here we are with the final cleanup from our uh, North Saskatchewan um, adventure, 0.164 grams. We worked for uh, three 20 minute intervals, uh, so actually not too bad. Easy shoveling, it was just pure black sand pretty much that we were shoveling in there. So um, it was a nice way to spend the afternoon, and uh, all this, look at how tiny this gold is that was captured by the VDR mats. Just let me zoom in there a little bit. Where's that pinhead, Greg? Let's throw that in there again. Do we have it handy? No. Okay, we lost the pin. <laughs> Sorry, we showed that earlier in the, um, in the pan, but thanks so much. Take care and uh, have a great day. To infinity and beyond.